Adam, it's Friday night. It's the weekend. <laughs> Got a little Friday dinner cooking up here. Laura made some fried rice and a little salmon. And Adam's ready to try salmon, right? Yay! <laughs> we've got an exciting weekend, but I don't know what's planned. No, we've got a lot to do. We're celebrating Mother's Day this Yeah, weekend. Mother's Day weekend. You ready to celebrate, Adam? You want some more? You're just squirreling that stuff away in your cheeks? Can I see? Open up. Bonk. Yum, yum, yum. Mother's Day morning. We've just arrived. The secret spot. The secret. <laughs> The Chicago Botanical Gardens. It's supposed to be a hidden gem in Chicago's north side. This will be really fun. Should be fun to poke around for a day. This is Richard's dream. That's a massive bomb bag. What do you think? I like that. He's been dying to make a bonsai. <laughs> that would be so cool. Did you know the plants would match your coat today? It's like oh, cool. convenient, everything's pink. It's like you're wearing camouflage. <laughs> yeah. Well, we had a lovely time at the Botanical Gardens. Thank you, honey. It was really nice. Trip and everything was so beautiful, all nice and in bloom. Yeah, great. Right? We're heading back home. Yeah, Adam is playing with his little toy that we've dubbed Adam's Adams, and we've got about a, an hour drive back home, and then we're gonna get some stuff done. Good morning, baby. Did you have a good sleep last night? <laughs> Yeah. Good morning. We had a great day yesterday. It was so much fun to explore the botanical garden and now we're just having some breakfast. This morning we blended up the uh, fruit from our fru fruit salad yesterday for Adam and he seems to be enjoying it. Yeah. You want more? You need more? Richard and I are working on finding an apartment in Los Angeles, which is a very daunting process. So we spent most of last night um, poking around online, looking at all these different options and trying to figure out the, what the neighborhood would be like. And I think we're starting to get things narrowed down a little bit. What do you think, honey? Yeah, I think we know where, what neighborhood we want to be. Close to work for both of us. Safe. It's just too expensive, <laughs> so we don't want to do it. But we'll find a compromise. We'll find something. All right. Okay, baby, I'll feed you. Don't worry. We decided that we needed another adventure this weekend, so we are going to the Illinois Railway Museum, which is about an hour outside of Chicago, and it's, I think, the biggest railway museum in the country. And so um, we decided to go check out some trains.
This is appropriate, huh? This Take them to the zoo. Right to the zoo. <laughs> we wrote to the zoo, Adam, to send us a pet. They sent us a choo choo train. Yay! <laughs> I think it's interesting how all of these cars have so much history. They know like, where they started, who made them. Yeah. You know, when they switched to different lines, when they were refurbished. Yeah. I kind of thought a locomotive was a locomotive, but apparently right. they keep track of what's going on with them. The enthusiasts will figure out all the little details. Yeah. The wheels are That's huge. Laura standing next to the wheels of this. Immense steam locomotive. It makes Adam look especially pipsqueaky. Oh my gosh. Wow. Here's the Darth Vader train engines. Yes. <laughs> look at that one. John, cool. what is it? <laughs> yeah, what is it? Like an icebreaker train engine. Looks like the Titanic. Yeah, right? to ride on that one. I know, that was really fun. This whole museum was really, really fun. I'm glad we made the trek out here yeah. to see it before we left. We've been talking about it for a while. Yeah, and good day for it too. We got a cool poster about the train line between Chicago and Los Angeles, which is appropriate. very fitting. Yep. <laughs> so it's a beautiful day. We're gonna go head back home and enjoy the sunshine. Bye for now.